Hello, people. How's it going? Hope all is well today. We're back on FM22 on our manager reputation challenge here in the championship with Aston Villa. Yes, a couple of episodes ago, we joined Aston Villa. We've got the Aston Villa job here in the championship, trying to uh, take them back to the Premier League days. One thing I just realised, uh, Middlesbrough manager is actually Frank Lampard. Eddie Howes at Sheffield, United, uh, Sheffield Wednesday. So uh, there are a couple of big names in the championship with us. Mr. Uh, Mr. Frank Lampard, crazy. Uh, we're currently second in the league. West Bromwich Albion are first, and we have them first here in this episode at home before, going, uh, uh, before Blackburn come to visit. A special listen fellow. I'm embarrassed for him. I'm not. The one important thing about management, you've got to be able to make decisions that are unpopular, but know you're right. They played a game extra than us, but we are joined on points. So we do have a game in hand, which I'm guessing is somewhere. Uh, top goal scorers, Louis Barry, currently has six. He's up there. Uh, we're, we're, we're liking it. We're enjoying ourselves in the championship so far. Doing rather well since last episode, uh, which was, I want to say, Preston? I think it was Preston. Uh, yeah, we drew one, drew, yeah. Uh, we won 3-1 at home against Swansea. Graham, Do uh, Graham Dodds got a brace. Uh, Russell Thompson got a brace away against Cardiff in the EFL Cup. And then back in the Championship, 1-1-0 away against Ipswich. Louis Barry getting the winner there. Today, we're going to play West Brom, Blackburn, uh, maybe Barnsley, Stoke. We'll see how far we go. We'll see how far we go. But, uh, yeah, so far, not too shabby. Our reputation is up to 60% now as uh, three stars. As... We just tried to, 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 to continue our manager reputation challenge, trying to get to five stars. Of course, VPK, Agro, Dan, Christensen, Dan, now we're in England, uh, really, really enjoying our time. We've spent a lot of money on this Aston Villa team, a lot of money. Uh, so hopefully we can get some uh, some trophies for this team and, and, and really take them. I mean, the, the views... I've been doing decent this whole series, but they they, they they started doing better as soon as we joined Aston Villa in the, in the championship. So um, I feel like FM always does better when you're in England anyway. So hopefully you guys, you know, hopefully you guys are enjoying it more. Maybe now that we're at a team that you're familiar with in Aston Villa in England. Maybe that's why. I don't know. But uh, yeah, uh, for the new people, maybe you've just joined. Thank you for, for joining this series. If you've been watching since the beginning, thank you as well. Uh, it does mean a lot. All the likes, comments and stuff like that on this series because I love this series. I want this to be a long series. So when you guys support it, it just makes me that extra bit happy. So thank you very much indeed. Russell Thompson starting on the right-hand side. This youngster is absolutely phenomenal. Uh, he's definitely starting on the right-hand side. Gordon on the left, Broha and Louis Barry up top together. I want to get keep... See, everyone's playing well. It's high. It's difficult to pick a team when everyone's on form. We still have Budimir to come back. He's still up for six weeks. Ethan Laird's up for three weeks. Everyone... Is just playing amazing right now. We'll go with that. At home against West Brom, it is first v second. I have a bowl of noodles here, so you may see me eating as we manage. But, you know, we can eat on the sideline. That, 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 that's more than fine. <laughs> I have a question for you, actually. Speaking of, like, if you've just joined or, or, or if you've been watching. When was... Let me turn the sounds on for YouTube. When what? When did you start this series? Did you start at the right beginning at VPK Agro in Norway, uh, in Ukraine, sorry? Did you join in Norway at Christensen? Did you just join now at Aston Villa? Let me know when you found this series and when you first started watching it. That will be really interesting to know. Gordon, lovely ball. Oh, bro. Oh, he's at the post and gone wide. Barry keeps it alive. Gordon absolutely scuffs it. Wow. Here is Gordon again on the left-hand side. Sorry for eating mid-video, by the way. It's the first thing I've eaten all day. I've recorded two, episodes, uh, two videos. I've edited two videos. This is my third video I'm recording of the day, and it's my first thing I've eaten. Uh, Russell Thompson on the right side, into Bro header. Oh, good save. No one can get their feet on the end of it. Seven shots to that. We're dominating West Brom. We're dominating. Again, we don't need two league tables. I'll keep the league table here, I think. Oh, no, actually. Um, well, why don't that be the league table? This can be our formation. Ah. Oh. And that can be their formation. There we go. Lovely stuff. Oh, right on half time. Surely not. March out to Lowry. In the box. Back to March. Oh, my God. Oliver Burke. Is he on side? Oh, my God. See, this is what I was going to say. They've had absolutely nothing. All game. 
absolutely nothing. And of course, they go and score first. Of bloody course, they go and score first. It's typical to be dominating them and they go and score. It's typical. Come on now, boys. Let's stop messing about now. Go a bit more direct. Let's stop messing about now, boys. Come on. Ponsa, back to Steph. Uh, Brohood's going to come off. We're going to go for Graham Dodds up top, I think. Graham Dodds. We're actually going to move Louis Barry out to the left and bring Farris up. Ball up to Brohood. Louis Barry. Oh, I could cancel it here. Russell Thompson on the right side. Run the goalkeeper. Goes wide. He goes wide. We're on such good form. What a shocking start to the episode this would be. Why is this actually being serious right now? We've been peppering them, boys. This is our rivalry as well, of course. The West Midlands derby. Oh, my God. They made it too. Keeper scuffed it right to the lap. They've made it too. I can't be bothered. Typical FM. Typical FM. It's football. You know, it happens sometimes. You dominate and things just don't go your way. Charlie Patino free kick. That goes wide. Full time is 2-0. In a rivalry game... 18 shots to 8, 2.45 XG. This wasn't meant to be. Absolutely hate games like that. I'm hoping that that match wasn't a sign of things to come this episode. Because if it is, you're seeing a very, very angry manager at the end of this episode. If we carry on like that. Home against Blackburn. They're fifth in the uh, sixth. Sixth or fifth? I can't remember. Um, Right then. Uh, it's in national break after this, so we have a long break. So we can play some tired players, knowing that they'll get a break. Um, Lee Mitchell up top is... Um, where's Mr... Where's the Russell guy? Where's the right winger? Russell Thompson. Oh, he's not that fit. He's not that fit. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Lerma and Douglas Louise in the middle. Uh, I'm going to start uh, Charlie Patino, actually. Instead of Douglas Louise, I'm going to start Charlie Patino. Need to get him going a bit. Um, You know what? We'll start Farris. Broher and Farris up top together. Let's be having your boys. Villa Park against Blackburn. We need three points now. After West Brom getting three last match. Ay, ay, ay. Aye. Uh, so what we're going to do is instant result that game. Because for some reason, every time I click on Blackburn, my game freezes. So I feel like they are, for whatever reason, bugged right now in this save um or just today i've had some issues with fm freezing recently um so i'm just going to simulate that match and move on hopefully the next match works if not i'm i'm going to be very annoyed if i'm honest if i have to troubleshoot some stuff but hopefully we can get three points after a 2-0 home loss against west brom if we lose two home games i'll be fuming oh my god we lost one nil we actually lost we dominated them again we've dominated them again and we lose one nil Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Right, in national break to clear our head. Uh, we have Charlton away next. Sheffield United away and Bristol home. We'll play these three matches and we'll call it in and there. Jesus. Please, no injuries. Please, no injuries. Please, no injuries. No. No more injuries than we already have. Matty Cash, two weeks. Booting me back in three weeks. Okay. Okay, not bad international break from the boys. It's always nice to look. Obviously, we're, we're very comfy in our Aston Villa job. And I, and I do feel, feel like we're going to be here for at least, you know, three, four years. I feel like it's going to be a longer mission here than it was at Christensen or VPK Agro. But I'm just going to look if there's any international jobs or anything like that. I'm not, I'm not you know, interested in clubs. But, of course, uh, international jobs can always boost your reputation as well. Nothing too exciting, Bruin, just yet. Nothing too exciting. We have Charlton away next. Back-to-back -back home games lost. Uh, very, very annoying. Hopefully now in the the back-to-back -back away games, we can pick up some form. Charlton and Sheffield Wednesday before going back home to Bristol City. Broha and Louis Barry up top for this game. Let's hope it doesn't freeze when we end, uh, end the game this time. Russell Thompson back on the right-hand side. Gordon on the left. Uh, I'm not liking Douglas Louise. Danny Ceballos. Fit into the midfield, why don't you? Right, I fixed it. I can click on all teams again now. It was because bloody OneDrive was trying to download something. Or I, I don't really know. I don't really understand. Is it because they don't have the kits? It popped up OneDrive was trying to download something and I blocked the app and now it's working. If they don't have their bloody 2D kits, I, I couldn't care less. That's fine. As long as it works. Okay, let's get into the match away from home against Charlton then. Watch it just crash again now. <laughs> Me thinking I fix it. Watch it just crash again. Boom. There we go. It was all because of bloody one drive. Oh, my goodness. Caused me so much ag that did on this game. Right. Charlton take on Aston Villa. We have a corner. Russell Thompson puts in. I've been trying to fix that for like half an hour now. Can I just say? 
Jesus Christ almighty. Afen Gruber into Isaac Hayden. Gordon on the left. Barry. Gordon takes it on him. Out to Mitchell on the left. Gordon. Hayden. Maybe try someone get a cross in there. Do bro her open. Had a lovely header. Third of the season for him. 1-0 Villa. Oh, nice ball through. It's a tight angle. We pushed him out wide. Saranich in. Thorpe. Nice finish. Makes it 1-1. Our lead does not last. On the left-hand side. Back to Mitchell. Ball up again to Gordon. Oh, tight angle. Second of the season. Lovely finish. 2-1 right before halftime. We need three points, boys. We need three points. Come on. We're now six off West Brom with a game in hand. Which may be this game. I'm not sure, actually. I didn't quite check. I think it's this game or next game. Oh, he's just pulled up. He's just pulled up. We're carrying on. Up to the right, Thompson. Whips it across. Oh, if we scored after he pulled up, that would have been absolutely hilarious. Last highlight before halftime. Then Thompson. Down the left-hand side. He's absolutely incredible. Ceballos. Ball in. Keeper does not keep it out. Broher gets the goal. Ceballos actually gets the assist. And it's 3-1. Flying high. Oh, I was replying to a message. And we, we scored again. Did Gordon score? I, think, I don't know who scored that one. I can't remember who scored before. See, it's actually ridiculous how we couldn't do this at home against West Brom or bloody Blackburn. It's actually ridiculous. We, we should have been on a nice win streak still. And instead, we dropped two games at home. Unbelievable. Oh, nice ball. Saranic. Nice finish. 4-2 is first of the season. Goal galore here. 4-2. Broha and Thompson having a good game so far. It's Thompson with the corner. Oh, key praise. Shot gets blocked. We keep possession. It's Ceballos back out to Russell Thompson. Isaac Hayden. Danny Ceballos. Mitchell on his right foot goes wide. Bro is having a great game, but he's a bit tired. Going to bring on Graham Dodds. We'll bring on Mr. Charlie Patino. And we'll bring on Farris up top. Three subs. Bish, bash, bosh. Dominating performance on the XG and the goals and the shots. I mean, we absolutely dominate them away from home. Lovely, lovely to see. We're sixth in the league. After those two losses. Wow. Oh, I fixed the kits. It was using our old kits for some reason. But I fixed them now. There we go. Easy peasy. I'm learning. For some reason in my files, I had the old kits on top of the new kits. Which I thought I'd delete the old kits. But hey-ho. A lot of shenanigans happened today. My FM's been really buggy recently on Twitch as well. Link in the description. We stream every Monday, Thursday, Friday at 2 p.m. GMT. What a plug. Go follow us, please. Right, I'll play two more games. Sheffield Wednesday away and Bristol City at home. We'll play two more here. Uh, before calling it an end of the episode. Sander Mass going to start on the left. We haven't played him too much, to be honest. Um, Morgan Sanson back on the right-hand side. Louis Barry is a bit tired. Is a bit tired, oh, but I like Lee Mitch. No, we'll, play, we'll, we'll play Morgan Sanson. We'll play Broa with Farris. Been a while since we've seen Farris. Uh, Douglas Louise. And Lerma. Again, not a big fan of Douglas Louise, but we don't... You know what? Charlie Patino. My boy, Charlie Patines. Going to start with Lerma. Boom. I've done it. I've done it. It's done. Let's do it. Right. The actual correct kits on this time. Sorry about that last game. I was in a blue kit, which we don't even have. Um, Here's Lerma into Charlie Patino. Sanson. One more to Isaac Hayden on the right-hand side. Pass it across. Sanamas open goal. He misses. He gets the assist nicely, though. And Broha gets the goal. I'm kind of glad it worked out the way because Sandamas is a youngster. I'm glad he's getting assist on the left wing. He's more like a cam. He's like slow, but uh, Brohart, I think, is our top goal scorer. So it's nice to see him score. I think we're now two games behind West Brom. We have two games in hand of them now, I believe that said. We'll have a look after. Oh, speaking of, West Brom losing at the Hawthorns against Sunderland, who I'm pretty sure have no manager. They sacked their manager unless they sign someone else. Beating West Brom away from home, we need that. Has it. Out on the right-hand side. He goes back to Isaac Hayden. Charlie Patino, former Arsenal man. Lerma into Mitchell. Goes for a long shot. Rockets off the post and out. Sanson ball in. Affen Gruber. Oh, my God. How has he missed that? Farris. Broha. Oh, Farris chasing. He can't get it. But Broha can a cross goal. <sighs> Got to do better there. Got to do better there. Got to do better there. Another game where we're dominating the opposition away from him. Affen Gruber. Great save keeper. Sanson, I am off camera. Affen Gruber scores. I am a bit down here because I'm stroking my cat who's under my desk right now. <laughs> David Affen Gruber at the back. Been an amazing sign. Can I just say, right, not to toot my own horn or anything. We have built an incredible team here at Aston Villa. We made some 
big. I mean, granted, West Brom down 2 0. Granted, we spent like 148 mil. But we, for a championship team spending over 100 mil, you can't. It's not like you can. It's not like a champion. It's not like Man City spending 100 mil where they can go sign Haaland or Mbappe on a free or stuff like that. We're very limited on who we can sign in the championship. And I think we've signed some incredible players. I think we've really made an amazing Aston Villa team here that can fight for the Premier League. Well, not for the Premier League, but fight in the Premier League. Next season. Right, Farris are going to come off. We'll bring on Louis Barry. Sanson's had a great game out on the right. Um, We'll take off Affen Gruber just for some rest. Keep pray on. Oh, referee. No, bro, has stayed on his feet. Isaac Hayden playing right back this game. Patino, Sanson, Hayden. Back up to Sanson. He wants to get across in. He finally does. Into Broha. Goes back to Sanson. One more to Mass. No, Isaac Hayden. No. Broha, oh, goes to nothing. I should mount a camera above my cat where he sits on his little thing down there and do a cat cam for streams. That'll get me some some great views on Twitch. Seriously, go follow us. Link in the description every Monday, Thursday, Friday, 2 p.m. GMT. Oh, we hit the crossbar. John Jules, didn't he used to play for Arsenal as well? Arsenal youngster. Long shot. Oh, come on, Stefan. Come on, Stefan. That wasn't even in the bottom. If that was in the bottom corner, I would have said great goal. Wasn't even in the bottom bins. 2-1. Let's not do anything silly now, boys. Come on. Sanson, keep ray. Oh, it goes wide. Morgan Sanson, 9.5. Oh, no. Offside. 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 Oh, my God. They disallowed it. VAR. VAR, you hero. They disallowed the equalizer. Oh, my God. My heart. My heart. Oh, it's 90th minute. Oh, it's 90th. Please. We've been through enough heartache losing two home games. Let's not let them equalize. 90th minute, boys. Instead, let's go get a third. Patino. Mitchell. Mass Mitchell. Mass Mitchell. Mitchell wins it. Graham Dodge through. Louis Barry. One on one. Around the goalkeeper. Okay. Okay. 3-1. Three, Three points. Happy me. Lovely stuff. Oh, my God. My heart there. For a second, I thought FM were going to do me dirty. Up into third now. Two games off Middlesbrough and West Brom. West Brom have lost two games now as well. So yeah, we're two games off them. Interesting. Look how beautiful that is, by the way. Staff is underrated. We don't have the best physios. I understand. But look at those coaching. All yellow. All the best. We have the best uh, uh, scouts as well. Can't beat a good coaching team, boys. Right, Bristol City back at home. We have to end at home. Let's see what we can do. We need redemption after those two losses. That's what we need at Villa Park here. Dennis Spice and Douglas Louise in the middle. Uh, Graham Dodd's been playing well. I want to keep him in. He has 16 heading. He wants to be a target forward, but he's bloody... There's no point in that because he's 5 foot 10. What other role uses heading? Louis Barry, Morgan Sanson on the left-hand side. I forgot he can play on the left. Russell Thompson on the right. Ethan Laird sneaking back into the team. Just come back to full fitness. Last game of the episode, Aston Villa take on Bristol City. This is not one of our games in hand because West Brom are playing too. I don't know when our games in hand are as Aston Gruber goes over. Um, because, the, the, yeah, every time I think it's our game in hand, it's not. Marco Aurelio Finnegan's there. Oh, Stefan. We bought Stefan off Matt. Oh, they disallowed it. Hey, again, we love VAR. We bought Zach Stefan off Man City. I thought he was going to be a solid keeper. We do have a young goalkeeper in our team as well. But he's definitely, he's not, he's not good enough to be starting yet. But um, I, don't, I don't know. I still, I still believe in uh, in Zach Stefan. I think he's a good goalkeeper, don't get me wrong. But definitely be doing better. He concedes a lot more goals than I wanted, if I'm honest. Here's Vale. Bristol in our box again. Why are we losing games at home now? Look, Open Gorilla, where is he? Open, he's flumbering nowhere. And we actually go 1-0 down. He makes some silly, silly mistakes, I'll be honest with you. If we lose at home again, I will genuinely be furious if we lose three home games. West Brom go 1-0 up. Why are Bristol attacking again? Why are they attacking again? Why is Villa Park all of a sudden a, 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 a crap show? Oh my god, they hit the post. Right, now Sanson's having a stinker. As is Louis Barry, to be fair. Uh, oh, Bro has not on the bench. Bro. Mm. Barris, come on. Oh, I wanted Bro. Oh, you... Lee Mitchell. Lee Mitchell, come on. Um, Louis Barry on the left. Oh, God, this stinks. This stinks. This stinks. I thought we had Broher on the bench. I thought that was a handball. Diving header clearance. I paused because I thought I was waiting to see handball or push or something. Come on, boys. Come on. 
A quick second half goal, equalizer. Then we have the whole second half to get the winner. What was that? What? Ceballos. Dodds. Through, no. Parod. Get it in there, get it in there, get it in there. Ceballos, someone cross it in. Thompson turns the defender, whoops it across Lee Mitchell. Thompson to Mitchell, the two youngsters. Lovely stuff. They're calling for offside. They can go bum themselves, mate. 1-1. One, one. West Brom are 2-0 up. Oh, we're 2-1 down. Well, I was just going to give her like an inspirational speech. We're 2-1 down. Never mind. Well, I was going to say, I don't want I don't want to lose them. I want to stay close to them. But, um, yeah, I think that's done now. Oh, my God. I actually thought... I'd... Listen, the season's not done yet. I'm not going to say it's done now. Very early on in the first half of the season. But we, 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 we had such a good start. We was on such a good run of form. And I, I, I think we have the best team in the league. I think we should be winning the league. Faris goes over. I think we should be winning the league. I definitely want to get in Premier League next year. I mean, I know we have playoffs and stuff, but I don't want Middlesbrough and West Brom to be flying off. We lose 2-1. We lose our... Okay, we need to change something at home. We need to change something at home, ladies and gentlemen. If you have enjoyed, please do leave a thumbs up on the video. Remember to subscribe if you haven't already. All my social media links down in the description down below. Go follow us on Twitch. We stream every Monday, Thursday and Friday at 2 p.m. GMT. I've been Hattu V. Austin, the Kid, and I'm signing up. Bye-bye for now. Much of as always. Take care and peace. I can't believe this kid My stand up for an idiot kid Slap see a man get murked Two paintings and a whip I'm a read this kid In the back like Donnie Demur Sat in the back like Donnie Demur I think the blonde thing's feeling Harry He in the middle He putting in work Coming like Sutton Like Coffee Kawasi If he up top Then he's scoring a hattie Same way he does When a man plays clubs This year the Brody hit 10k Next year that's 55